A number of video creators overlook the benefits of using the mirror effects in the VSDC editor. Let's look at how it can add greatly to your production. It is great for special effects, text effects, title backgrounds, video openings, and very artistic. Let's look at some of the examples to introduce you to this feature. Place your video or image on the editor. Place your cursor where you want to split the scene, usually about halfway. Then go up to the editor and select Split Scene. Now, highlight the first scene. Go over to the Properties window and under Crop Borders, change the setting to 200% and click Enter. Now go up to the Video Editor again and select Video Effects. Go over to Transformers then to Mirror. With Mirror highlighted in the timeline, go over to the Properties window and select the direction that you want the mirror to take place. In this case, we selected from the bottom. Then select Mirror Levels. Click on Line of Parameter Choices. Then increase the second to say 0 to 21. Preview the change to your taste. If you use two levels, it will use the entire length of the scene. It gives the illusion that she is in water. Now, highlight the other split scene. Follow the same procedures, except reverse the settings to 21 to 0 and watch the water drain. Works great with text. Highlight your text box, then mirror. Now go up to the video editor and select video effects over to transformers, then to mirror. With mirror highlighted in the timeline, go over to the properties window and select the direction you want the mirror to take place. In this case, we selected from the bottom. If you don't want a slow process, and want a straight mirror effect, you can set your settings to 50-50 and move the bottom of the text box to about half of the box so that the text fits. Don't forget, you can even do it on a green background. Then export it and place it on the scene. Be creative. Have fun. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.